All right, everybody. Welcome back. I'm your host with the most KR Podcast. We out here. All right, basically, I want you to see this for yourself. Firsthand information that I just saw from Tom's Hardware. Now, again, I don't know what crack NVIDIA smoking. I don't know what crack ASUS smoking. And I don't know what crack Natua smoking. Now, I will say that Natua makes great fans. I would like to say that personally got the 4080 Founders Edition. And, you know, I love it. Not going to sit down and lie. But this is a new edition that they have, which they've done before. But my biggest thing is the price. Okay. First of all, let's look at the picture so y'all can see. This is what it look like. All right, basically it's your 4080 edition, right? With not two of fans in it. Now, again, we're hoping that it's gonna be very silent and quiet, and of course, very formidable. Now, as we scroll down, look at it. The RTX 40 not two of measures. 310 by 145 by 87.5, occupying 4.3 slots. I want you to say that again, 4.3 slots. That is a big behind card. So this is the box. Switch, yep. And one more. Again, I, I think that is very interesting. Look at it as we scroll down a little bit more gives us a little bit more about it. Again, I'm not saying that this is not a very nice and beautiful card. And you know, across a, a game test suite, for example, the RTX 4080 Founders Edition averaged between 2720 megahertz as much as 2820 megahertz. We just have to see how high the clocks run on the Asus Natua card once they get it testing. Now, again, this should be very low as in ie the noise level which i think that will achieve that again i like the way the card looks but again my biggest issue is going to be the price of this mother sucker because here we go to what everybody wanted to see first of all the founders edition which is on the right and the not two one is on the left first of all look how much big it is 4.3 slots that's huge second of all the price is going to be $1,649. Again, that, you can get a 4090. I don't care how quiet it is, you might as well buy your 4090. $1,649. Now, a lot of y'all already complained that the 4080 is way overpriced. So you telling me, because it threw some Natua fans in it, all of a sudden that it's worth $1,649? I want you to hear something real quick. If you listen, you barely hear any noise. I am currently sitting right here on the computer, right next to the 4080. The fans ain't even spinning. Founders edition. So you telling me that you want me to switch from what I have to the Natua one because it just has Natua fans aesthetics for over 40% more? Again, I'm not knocking it. I'm just simply saying that is a very hard pill to swallow. I mean, the 4080 Rod Strix is $1599. I, 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 again, I am not a hater. Again, if you got the money, by all means, you should go and go out and get the best because you deserve the best. But when you look at it from this picture right here, 4.3 slots is a big ass card. And again, I just can't see justifying $1,649 for a 4080, we can go ahead and get you a 4090. Now for you ballers out there, obviously that's what you're gonna get, but I just wanted you to see this because I was looking at it real time and I was like, wow. Again, the car looks beautiful. If you into that aesthetically look of not to a fans, but the price, man, is just crazy. $1,649 for that, man. I'm like, wow. I had to put this up because I wanted y'all to see this. It sees anybody else besides me saying, what the freak again not a hater just simply telling you that for that type of money wow just because you added not to a fans again it should run quieter but again you listen to the founders edition currently right now and you don't hear nothing can't justify it can't see it but in the comment section below let me know have they lost their damn mind i catch you on the next one Peace.